We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Yeah. Woo! Wow. Happy Christmas, everyone. This is the... Ho, ho, ho. Exactly. We're joined here today by two very important guests. Welcome to Discussing Nothing Christmas Special. We Woo. hope you're having a great time wherever you are. Having a... Having, you know, having a bloody Merry Christmas, you know? Uh, today... I'm joined by two very important people in my working life. That's it. <laughs> I'm joined by Bloomin' Santa Claus, Alex, <laughs> and what appears to be a hostage of Santa Claus's, <laughs> Aylin. Can you move? Not comfortably. Not co- <laughs> well. It's all very still. Yeah, I'll just be still. We've just we've just tied you to this chair purely to podcast, and then okay. you'll be released. Okay. okay. Yeah. But yeah, bit of preamble. Uh, Alex, any nice plans for Christmas? Uh, I'll. I think the fam. Everyone's coming to my house, which mm. is usual because I cook Christmas you, Christmas yeah. dinner on the barbecue. You know a, what I'm like a turkey barbecue. Oh, why? <laughs> It'll be uh, three carrots on the barbie. Uh, you know what? It, previous years, I, the thing is. I don't want to get into kind of barbecue law, but when it comes to like actual we could be space, here for hours. yeah, we could be. But when it comes to actual like real estate barbecue space, once you've got a big old turkey there, it's not got much left. You have to start branching out to two, three barbecues, and I'm not, you know, not quite at that stage. So currently, no. That's the long answer to your question. <laughs> could have said no. Well, yeah, no, I could have. Alan, <laughs> I n- I know your plans for Christmas, but I believe you're not happy about them. What are they? Well, <laughs> um, I usually would prefer to spend Christmas in the cold. In yeah, you're not no, you're, you're but not I'm, unhappy. But I'm just, going home. You are very Christmassy person, yes, and you much prefer the cold weather. Yes, so I'm going to Australia for Christmas, and it's going to be summer. And will it make you feel very Christmassy? hot and not Christmassy at all? Mm. Oh. So. But we are treating November as Christmas. Yes. Yes. So, so I'm going to hopefully be all Christmas out. By Is then. it possible to Christmas you? Well, out? yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> well, but impo- I'm going to try my best. How many tattoos have you got? Christmas tattoos? <laughs> For clarification. <laughs> very personal question. <laughs> One. <laughs> One. <laughs> One's one enough. more than me one more than anyone else. Yeah. Oh, in on the podcast, in, on the on the po- <laughs> podcast specifically. Speaking of Christmas, woo! I've brought together these two very Christmassy characters and me, a turkey, <laughs> to discuss what are the top five Christmas things. They've both made a list. They're checking it twice. Boy. He's going to find out if we're naughty or nice. Um, but yeah, me and Alex will probably have a, a list that's pretty awful. But we've brought Aileen in because she is the Christmas queen and she will probably tell us the correct list. Mm. Who would like to start off? Alex, I will begin, you begin with my number five. What's your number five, <clears throat> Santa? <clears throat> thing about Christmas is Christmas tree day. What? I quite enjoy <laughs> Christmas tree day. That's the day when we go and get our Christmas tree. And it's just a great day. We we have it. We book it in the diary, and we know what we're gonna do. Obviously, <laughs> gonna go get the tree. <laughs> but then we get the tree, and we set it up, and we um, have some really nice food. And it's sort of like I guess Americans have Thanksgiving in the build up to Christmas, and we have Christmas tree day. When's Christmas tree day? Well, it depends. It it changes each year depending on when we get the Christmas tree. But it's normally a Saturday. Um, in December. Well, yes, it would normally be in December. However, I'm going away, which I didn't mention. I'm going away on the 27th to America for a few weeks. So we'll probably have it a little bit earlier, but still December. It'll probably be like right at the beginning of December. But Christmas tree day is one of my is my top fifth thing. I have never heard of Christmas tree day. No, no, it's a me thing. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> it's like our, our household thing. Uh, I don't... But I mean, lots of families, it would be like, we're going to go get the tree. My parents, um, we have shoot me for this an artificial tree i i don't i don't mind don't i mind don't it. mind an artificial tree you don't mind it uh, maybe it's because i grew up they, with they make a mess the maybe real it's because i yeah no, and they die they traditional die. it's but it's christmas like if there's one time to buy <laughs> and they don't look like unless you get a really nice and they're spiky <laughs> no what they're spiky. i think the artificial ones Helen, can I look really nice christmas <laughs> they're spiky no 
They are, but that's part of it. And they get you get to and they go. get everywhere. And no, then by you just January fourth, fifth, yeah, you're looking you at a tree and you're out. like, oh, we're gonna have to put this boy down. But you've got to store it all year round. Where do you look? You live on a farm. We have an so, attic. Yeah, but you've got a massive. You've got masses of land. Yeah. Well, where am I going to put my Christmas tree? Well, nowhere on my land. In the bin <laughs> every year. In the bin. Well, I put it in the fire. We burn it. You burn it. Oh yeah, we keep it in the back garden. Let it dry out. I think, in it. theory, a real tree is nice. Yeah, if but you, every if, time I've had one, it's impractical. No, it's not. What's What's your number five? Well, I went <laughs> quite broad because I couldn't really no. narrow them down. Aelin might have spent the whole evening thinking about these because <laughs> she's that passionate about the subject. Um. Well, actually, this is not that broad. Christmas markets mm. is my number five. I like Christmas markets. Um, we went to St. Wolfgang in Austria when I was nine, I think, and they had amazing Christmas markets. And also the Edinburgh Christmas markets used to be better. Yeah, what do you think about the, I think what do you think about the council bit bringing them in disrepute and small in name yeah. them? Yeah. They're, they're quite disappointing now. Like it takes you five minutes to walk through it and then you're done. Well, it was yeah. a chore. Oh, you yeah. didn't get one. I couldn't get one last year. <laughs> <laughs> and I was genuinely devastated. It was yeah. my Christmas I, what did I have? I had not mulled wine. It was mulled cider. Hmm. Oh, that was yeah. that was quite nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think the the Edinburgh one specific. I, f- I think if you go to a proper Christmas, yeah, market, like a good yeah. one, a good one. Yeah, but the Edinburgh ones have been. So, they Europe. used to be magical. Yeah, they used to be great. Mm-hmm. My number five. They do. Do you think we've grown up? No. So what? No, no, I think no. They're they, way they smaller. Got, it used to. It used to be like all the levels. Three levels. Like the whole. Yeah. No, but we've grown up. We're not, we're not bigger, no. And so it just feels... <laughs> do you know what I mean? No, it, no. it was literally on three yeah, levels before. <laughs> and now, now it's on one. And there was like the maze at the bottom. We have not everything. got yeah. that big. <laughs> I also wasn't a child when I went to them. <laughs> I, was, uh, I was a grown cider. man when I went right. to them. No, that's, I just wondered. I'm a big boy. You're, you're all grown up. <laughs> My number five, and I love this. I, I actually maybe wish I'd put it higher. Boxing Day. Wow! Oh, I love Boxing Day. Really? Boxing Day is great. Like, what do you do on Boxing Day? Oh, just lullaby. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing. It's great. You're just lullaby. Oh. You're watching some of the movies that are on yeah, TV. Yeah. You're getting turkey again. Leftovers. It's marinated yeah. as well in the gravy, and it's yeah. That's oh a yeah, good you shot. go on like a walk as well. Yeah. You might even go to the pub. You might. And it's just great. It's just, I think. Boxing Day is because Christmas Day itself can be quite stressful. Everyone's cooking, mm-hmm. everything's getting ready, but like family are there. You're yeah. trying to impress the ones you didn't want to invite. Boxing <laughs> Day is when, when mum's like, yeah, oh, it's this is this is my actual yeah, Christmas. Yeah. I think Boxing Day is elite. I think it's one of the greatest days of the mm. year. I might say it's better than actual Christmas Day. No, I I don't agree with that. No, 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 I played no, no. golf at seven a.m. on Boxing Day last year. Some last people year. do dips as well, and they it was so great. Water. The golf, it was great. It was freezing, mm. but it was it was a good round of golf. I really enjoyed that. Yeah. Right. What's your number fours? Mine similar number four is just the Christmas tree in general. I think it's a very mm. glorious thing to look at. Just want to quickly put that: out. Christmas trees in general, they're beautiful. They're lovely. They're one. Of the, they're a centerpiece for the Christmas decoration. What's your number four? My number four is Christmas movies. Mm. Well, are you talking like old timey wimey ones, or just all Christmas movies, or like the uh, Hallmark ones? Mm, probably not. No, or I think those are funny, but like I wouldn't like. We always had a tradition of like the lead up to Christmas, we'd like watch um, Home Alone, uh, Love Actually, uh, Elf. The Grinch and White Christmas. Those are all good. Yeah, yeah. great. And it was like all the lead up, like the days before. Elf. I love Elf. Elf. Elf's yeah. great. What's your number four? My number four is Hot Tub. And I'll tell you why. <laughs> this was going so well. This is really <laughs> wholesome. This was really nice. We're all just like, no, going, I, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. Hot, like, tub. hot Tub. Well, I have a hot tub. <laughs> You've never p- mentioned. No, I, well, maybe you mentioned the last podcast, but I don't think I mentioned any other ones. But anyway. <laughs> I I really like my hot tub and the best time to use it is when it's cold. And so it's just a really nice like hour and a half to two hours, like little block that is, and over Christmas you're off, you've got time just to chill. You can have a beer in the hot tub because you're probably not driving anywhere, you know, so it's not happening on Christmas day, but it's as part of the Christmas spirit is just like ugh, hot tub time. And that's what, that's what I like because it's cold. <laughs> ah, yes. Christmas time. <laughs> Hot tub time. Yeah, it is for me. It's it synonymous with one. I'm going to make a compilation of you just casually dropping in. You have a hot tub in every podcast. <laughs> Ross, I don't want to. I don't want to go too personal, but you will be in my hot tub tonight, and you will understand. I will be. 
And I will understand. You will. You <laughs> Is will. that a threat? You will be in my hot tub <laughs> You will be, and you will enjoy it. <laughs> Great. What's your number three? Let's go Wait, back. what's Aeon's number four? Well, no, she said uh, Christmas uh, movies. Movie. Oh, Christmas movie. Oh, yeah. What's your number four? Uh, Christmas tree. Oh, oh yeah. You went Give me your number three. No, sorry. Sorry, everyone. Sorry, sorry. Right, mine's weird old Christmas music. You know the... the I know mm. you hate these songs. I like, hate You those. know, like, the ones with, like... Uh, Paul McCartney goes. S- not for some. Is it Paul McCartney? Simply having a wonderful Christmas. You know those ones for the the E's, like Are you hanging up? Yeah, I hate Or oh, well, I wish it. it and even and the best Just one. Copyright. Maybe and the best one, like you know. Wish I was at home for Christmas. <laughs> you know the one that's barely about Man. Christmas. He's just talking about he's like fighting in the war. I yeah. love those. Those. I don't think. I don't think it's Christmas until my mum gets down this old CD, double-sided disc. It's got Feed the World on yeah, it. Yeah. It's got mm. all the... It's got the Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ. <laughs> got all that. Until my mum slaps that CD in, boosh. Bang. It's not Christmas. Wow. I love, I that. love that CD. Yeah, yeah. Scratched. Like, Mary, it's like, it's broken. It's about Mary's boy, 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 boy <laughs> child, <laughs> Jesus yeah, Christ. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Wow. Yeah, no, I like that. Why don't you like those songs? I don't know. I just like, because I think like we always had the old, old, old timey ones, mm. like the Dean Martin, Frank Sinatra, the like classic the kind ones. of crooner Christmas. Crooner. Mm. So like, I don't know. What's your number three? <sighs> My number three is snow. Now, it rarely <laughs> snows on Christmas. It doesn't. It, it, it's <laughs> rarely a white Christmas. It's normally February time. You're dreaming of one. I am, but uh, there's nothing more magical than Sunday morning. Whoop, 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 down the stairs, open the blinds, and there's just a little, whoop, a little white crusty, crustiness. I think now I hate snow, but Christmas Day is the only day I'll accept it. Hmm. Only day. Any other time of year, it's a nuisance. But on Christmas Day, I'll be like, "Hey, you don't like going for a walk in the snow?" No. Really? So it's cold. Yeah, but it's great. It's great. And your brother pushes you in the snow and you well, this sounds like snow all over you. Ah, so this is a childhood trauma. <laughs> and then he puts snow on your back and then he pelts you with snowballs. And he... yeah. Anyway, what's your number three? <laughs> well, my number three is actually the same as yours, but not those. I just like Christmas music, mm. in ge- but the good, the nice Christmas. The cr- not, nice, the, the nice. not the ones. Not- the annoying ones. Up your those style. are annoying ones. No, no. <laughs> Uh, right number two my number two and you're a liar if you don't think it is presents Mm. i love getting shit give me it really giving it fine whatever i'll give you a present actually it's quite nice giving you a present (laughs) yeah it's it's a good feeling but getting presents and when they're under the tree when you're younger when they're in your stocking and you still believed in santa Mm, that's a good thing (laughs) who's here of course we believe everybody (laughs) But like, oh, what a great, like, so much presence. Mm. Like, you're a liar if you don't think presence is like one of the top things. Yeah. What is your top two? What's your number, number two, I should my, say? My number two is my Christmas photo that I take every year <laughs> for the last <laughs> four years. We have a Christmas. Oh, it's all actually, your Christmas can we pajamas. Talk, can we dot them up all over here? Can we have them all? Ladies? We can. <laughs> yeah, you could. Um, so we take a Christmas photo every year. Lynn and I and our surrogate Emily, I don't Lodger. know what, Lodger, <laughs> who's been with us now four years. Lodger child, and we've just got surrogate. like it's like a nice little progression of our lives, and I think it's a nice tradition that we'll probably do forever now. You know, it's just fun to have like a little snapshot, and you just yeah, get to I see am. the development, or, even I, or the downfall, even I, <laughs> even I, big bully boy Ross can't mock that. That's pretty. Yeah, wholesome. do you know what I mean? And so yeah. I guess is the, the wider element of that is family. Oh, you know, it's just like. Good to have your mum and dad round. Number and, two, you know, family. So there's something better than family for you. Yeah, there is. <laughs> and we'll get there. What's your number two? My number two is a big category again, but uh, Christmas food. Mm. All of the, like, I love those Um, in Little. They always have, like, amazing, Biscuits. like, Scandinavian, like, um, Leb. Mm, Leb yeah. Cook, like, Leb Chuck. I never know. I've looked up how to pronounce it. Don't ask Ross. He's not good at pronunciation. And, like, Stolen and, like. No. It's so good. Mm. Mm. I love Christmas food. Well, that brings me to my number one. It's Christmas food, but specifically 
the pigs Christmas and blankets. Mate, that's my number one. Uh, pigs, pigs and blankets. And blankets. <laughs> that is really. Hard. I think uh, the whole meal in general. Yeah. But you're you're there for the piggies. That's what I'm here for. Hmm. Cozied up in their little blankies, their bacony blankets, and they're just sitting in like a in their juices, <laughs> and, just, and you just rip the heads off. Oh, and like ah. <laughs> oh. Like it's the best thing. Like I, I would also put. I right also now. want an honourable mention to cranberry sauce because I'm chucking oh. that on everything. Over no, the no, 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 no. That's you've ruined it. But the pigs and blankets <laughs> is fully, fully acceptable. <laughs> best blankets. thing about Christmas. Oh, it's the best thing about the meal, isn't it? Mm-hmm. It is. It like is. I maybe this year I haven't actually decided what I'm going to cook this year. Maybe I'll just do a one giant pigs and blankets and, blanket. and little turkeys. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> <laughs> wow. That is. I hope I do that. I hope I hope I look back when on this podcast when I watch it on Christmas Day with all the family. I'll be like, family, come and gather sit down. round. We're watching my podcast. Yeah, we, we, <laughs> there's nothing better. There's nothing else to do. There's incredible King Christmas speech, movies. Turn on. it off. That's Let's it. watch discussing, We're watching nothing. discussing nothing. And um, <laughs> I hope that I'm serving a giant pig and pigs and blanket, a giant pig and blanket, <laughs> giant sausage with mini <laughs> little, a massive little bacony turkeys. blanket. Oh wow! Can do you I, know, can I come to yours? Well, last year what I did was I did a turkey that was stuffed wrapped in bacon that's what i did on the barbecue last year mm. are you gonna do those potato things uh maybe i will i haven't actually i haven't got your to weird yet. potato cubes yeah those nah, it's gotta be roast potatoes i think it does yeah it's gotta yeah. be roasties in vinegar have you done those in vinegar bread sauce do you like bread in sauce vinegar. oh yes, okay, i can talk about and brussels. i also have to have one brussels sprout like yeah i agree like you mother, need to either like them. put it on yeah, like, yeah. you have to cranberry have one. sauce yes. bread sauce and brussels they're like my three least favorite <laughs> but, of they're all. Part, but they're part of it no 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 i understand i, I don't, don't like, like them. but i would always I have don't a brussels, like a brussels sprout, sprout yeah. but like it's Me tradition yeah yeah it's like mom's put and it's the first thing i eat it's the first thing no actually get rid of it cool stock she put a satsuma at the bottom added weight <laughs> just to make it feel a bit heavier <laughs> Ooh, and he's like, oh rubbish right Ailen. Christmassy queen Miss Christmas what My... is the definitive answer what is the best thing about Christmas I love all of the decorations oh. just like yeah oh. no well yes like, <laughs> like this some... and like on all of the the streets mm, so like lined with decorations lights. and all the lights and like in all the stores and like restaurants and like everything's just is I every room in your flat decorated during Christmas? Like, does each room have a Christmas decoration? Not yet. Not yet. No, but it will. Ooh. It will. Is it, <laughs> <laughs> say one day when you own your amazing Edinburgh townhouse, like in the new town, like yeah. beautiful. Will you have lights and stuff all outside? Will it be classy? It'll be or one of those houses trashy? that everyone takes a photo. You know, like oh. the one that everyone goes to, and they're oh. like, "Oh, that's the person that lives that in that." Your dream. The Not crazy trashy, Christmas though. woman. Not trashy, like the lives. Like, class, yeah, like classy. really. Yeah, and every yeah. year Not there'll like be an a theme. Inflatable, like Grinch, <laughs> <laughs> Grinch going. <laughs> <laughs> every year there'll be a theme yeah so like everyone will be like oh what's the theme yeah, this year yeah. oh, like you'll have a rep you'll be yeah. like, people will be like like that place oh, that there's like, there is a place that um i can't it's like near our old where we used to the mm. office used to be you know that where we had a get every town has one the person that covers their i think it's a business yeah. i don't know covers their house and like christmas lights it's interesting nice. well let's quickly go to our fellow colleagues the panel. watching away. Well, quickly rattle off what is some of your favorite things about Christmas? I have to agree, it being the decorations. Do because like the decorations? my mum is that woman with all the decorations. <laughs> 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 we have like a loft in our house and about three quarters of it is Christmas decorations. Oh. So my least favorite part about Christmas is when I have to help her take it down the loft. Mm. <laughs> but when it's all decorated, I think we have like mm. six or seven trees. <gasps> Fake trees. Wow. Well, so do you decorate like the I outside I want to go to your well? mom's house. Yeah, and she, yeah, they planted the Christmas tree in the back garden, which is permanently there, which is a bit weird because oh. it's not always Christmas. Kelvin. Wow. Mr. Jolly. Um, presents. Getting presents because yeah. I'm so. <laughs> <laughs> you got to love it. We're learning a lot, a lot about people's love like languages. Do you like giving presents? Yeah, yeah. As much as getting them? No, no. <laughs> um, but I do, I do really like snow on Christmas, mm. but... Any other I've never had a white Have, Having it like mm. any other, having like snow in January is like the worst thing. Yeah. But it's the worst. It is the worst. And Emma, I, I can't imagine you'll agree with the Christmas food. Well, actually, my favorite part is probably the whole present stuff. But I actually really enjoy Christmas food because I just get to eat so much shite. What does what do, but, what do you eat? Yeah, like a massive big tofu mushroom. <laughs> Are don't they the only me. veggie foods you can think of, Alex? A nut roast? <laughs> what else would you eat? I actually don't like nut roasts. But I normally just have some kind of fake meat thing. 
What are you having at our Christmas meal out? It's like a I mean, butternut what have you squash had? pie or something, but it actually mm. sounds quite nice. But I just like food in general. Mm. So it doesn't matter what it is, I'm just, I just yeah, like to eat Yeah, there's loads of snacks. I mean, by yeah. the time you actually get yeah. to Christmas dinner anyway. Mince yeah. pie? Uh, no, not a fan. Oh, well. Mm. Well, that, well, that was well. probably one of our more wholesome episodes. Yeah, I feel, I feel much so arguing. Christmassy. Yeah, I feel good. Well, have a good Christmas, Santa. Thanks, man. Enjoy delivering. It will be busy, but you know. <laughs> Yeah, at least the money's coming. At what? least uh, if it's it's good if you're busy. Gotta keep the dollar flying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You gotta keep. You gotta, pay gotta, those, just gotta keep a ticket over. Gotta keep those elves wains fed. Yeah, exactly. And Aylin, enjoy your Australian Christmas. Thank you. Good eye, mate. I'm just gonna keep this. Yeah, on. yeah. Well, you can't move. You're, yeah. you're, you're tied to the chair. We'll wheel you to the airport. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we wish all our one viewer a happy Christmas. Happy Christmas. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye. Ho ho ho.